Good morning and welcome to another vlog. It's going to be quite a productive day today. We're planning to go to Ikea just to get some bedroom cabinets and some storage for the office room. Quite excited for that just because Ikea trips are just like you just can't go wrong even if i'm like not trying to buy anything i'll go there for the room inspo just because i like the way that they set things up my outfit of the day is this blue woolly turtleneck jumper i think it's from mns got my cup of coffee that i probably won't finish before we leave so i'm just gonna put it in a reusable starbucks cup so it feels like I went out to Starbucks even though I did it so I've saved some money so we're here for that got my cup of coffee to go I just need to put on a coat and a neck scarf and we're good to go you say you don't want to get in trouble that you're doing fine because you got me I don't want to break your little bubble but you gotta wake up to reality
I'm just waiting for my cousin outside her house. Um, we're gonna go out for lunch for her birthday, which was last month, but we've just been so busy trying to make it up to her now. So we're just trying to go to like a nice restaurant. I wanted to go to like a steakhouse, but it's just too far to be honest. And it's just gonna be too much traffic. Um, so we're just gonna go another day with like maybe our mums with us as well as a nice treat for them. Um, but I was supposed to like go home after Ikea and change, wear something nice and fancy. But I was just gonna run late and I was starving. So I was like, I'll pick you up, we're going somewhere closer um, because the steakhouse is just too far. Um, so I was like, we're going somewhere closer because I feel like I'm shaking, like I'm actually starving. So I didn't have time to go and change. So I just left what I had on, like just my comfy jumper and trousers, but I've still got the ikea stuff behind me so literally it's yep so i'm gonna unload that into the house later after we've eaten and i go home um but i just dropped ollie off outside the house hi there um well, it's my yes please no Just got home, I think it's about nine o'clock, did a few errands. After I dropped my cousin off, went to Morrison's, just picked up a few things. Then I saw B&M, of course, had to go in there. It turned into a whole like little shopping spree, which I'm not mad about just because I got some cleaning stuff that I needed and then just random stuff that just came to my head whilst I was out. And then I went to my mum's, which was nice. Now I'm back home. Um, I'll show you a few things that I got from B&M but first thing is every time me and my sister-in-law go past um, Greg's and because it's like the Christmas period they always come out with like some festive drinks and I always always get mint mocha um, I think they do like mint hot chocolate as well which my sister-in-law gets but I bought this mint syrup at B&M and I just thought, you know what, if I can recreate the mint marker at home and the house. But I'm going to test it out, see if it's the same. If it is, that's it, I'm done going Greg's. I say that till I see Greg's again and obviously I don't have a hot drink with me. But I'm going to test this out and see if it's the same. And then I bought this candle. It's literally just like, oh, nearly dropped it um based the linen candle it just smells of like clean washing if that makes sense like um right now i'm not really that bothered about like the scent of the candles just because i always have like sprays in the room and stuff anyways i just need i've just got a thing like this time of the year i just always have to have a candle burning when i'm working and this will do it was five pounds but it lasts 65 hours which to be honest like it's great and i can reuse the glass thing when it's done
recently i've been trying out this simple micellar cleansing water with cotton wooling um wool pads just to take my mascara and like eyebrow gel or anything off or if i have eyeliner um and then i'll go in with like a facial scrub or something and just take it off and then finish off with the foaming face wash start off by adding um the micellar water to the pad and then i just go in um and just take my mascara off i don't know if this is the best way to do it i don't know if you're supposed to um I don't know scrub your eyes or whatever this much but that's just how i do it that's how i take it off and like literally all the mascara just comes off and then i just put that in the bin and then i just take my eyebrow gel off the same way and then just put the scrub on like i said i'm not very like precious with what scrub i use or anything just as long as it takes the gunk up in the face. I did about 30 minutes on the treadmill, just like a slow-ish walk. Not like proper running or anything. I don't do that in the night. Um, and I'm just going to watch one last video. I've been really trying to up my intake of water, but I just can't get like more than a glass in a day, um, which is so bad. Um, so I've been really trying to have like some sort of squash or something just so I can get my water intake, but like very minimal squash. So it's mostly water, if that makes sense. So I can trick myself, really, um, which is just hilarious. But I really do need to go to sleep. Um, got an early start tomorrow, but just going to have some of this drink see if i can finish the glass off and finish this video and then off to bed